Hey, what's going on guys? In today's video, I want to show you how you could rank in Google Maps in 2024. Watch this. This video is dedicated to my friend, Darren Marion. I love you, brother. All right, guys, I hope everybody's doing great today. Look, everybody wants to be found right here in the Google 3 pack. That's why you guys click this video. And I want to show you a neat way of how I've been working, um, a method that I've been using to get my clients in the Google 3 pack, right? Okay, so the first thing you need to do is you need to have a uh, um, an SEO grid program. The one that I use is Local Falcon. That lets you know where you're ranking in your town. So, for example, you may be ranking where you where you um, registered your GMB, but if you drive five or ten miles away, you, you won't be found on the Google Maps, right? If you drive ten or fifteen miles away from this area, this whole listing changes. Right. But you want to be found if somebody drive, you know, if somebody's 10 or 15, 20 miles away. The only way to the only way to check that is to use a grid program. And the grid program, I suggest, is the easiest one to use. It's called Local Falcon. I have a link in the description below if you'd like to use it or if you want to just go to Local Falcon, that's fine. So let's get into the meat and potato. Come on, guys. Be one of the cool kids. Like and subscribe. <clears throat> Come on, guys. Be I don't know, I got this thing about calling BARD, I call it, uh, okay, so um, Google has their own AI version of like, like you know, like ChatGPT, but Google's version is called BARD. And it's real simple, all you do is go to BARD, B-A-R-D, dot Google, dot com. And you just go over to uh, BARD, you fill out the information, you click go and you, you'll find you'll come to a page like this and you put in your question super easy to use so I got this thing where I call Bard Barty and I was like hey Barty and uh, sometimes it corrects me and like it, it gets mad it's like hey my name isn't Barty but and I don't know I've been doing it you know for a couple of months now it, it, it kind of likes it I think I don't know so I said hey Barty you know I I need you to put on your local SEO hat and think exactly like an experienced SEO. I'm trying to rank locally in 33782, you know, the zip code for roofing contractor. So at first attempt, it, it basically gave me, um, you know, the generic response. And I got a little, I got a little mad at Bart. Like it was like, you know, claim your GMB and, you know, uh, uh, optimize your GMB profile. I'm like, look, Anybody that's watching this video has already done everything and they're pulling their hair out of their head to get ranked. Um, so I have to think of some, like somebody like that. And I was like, look, I need you to analyze the three Google business listings that I sent you before and tell me what I'm missing. And it went on and says, look, unfortunately, I don't have enough information. However, I could offer some general observations. Um, and... I was like, well, what type of more information do you need? And it says, oh, give me the, give me your business. So that's what I should have put in. I put in the competition, but I didn't put in, you know, a business, you know, any, any type of business. So I put in a competitor. I just picked anyone. I put it in a competitor. I was like, look, uh, JDI roofing and contracting. Um, that's the one that we're trying to rank that, that person. I'm not trying to rank it. I just picked somebody who was in eighth and ninth place, but I want to show you what it did. Bard is a Google product. So I trust Bard over like ChatGPT or anything like that because this is being fed from Google, right? So it said that uh, JDI roofing, the strengths are it's clear and concise. It has a broad range of services. But here's the areas of improvement. This is what we needed to do. You know, if we were going to rank this one, we consider adding more description and a highlight of unique selling points, right? experience, customer service, uh, customer service warranties. These are the things that Google is looking for to trust your website to rank it higher in Google Maps. Utilize relevant keywords with your description and categories, right? I always say use the area and the keyword you're trying to rank. So for example, 
uh, Pinellas Park, right? That's the town and residential roofing. Showcase high, showcase high quality photos. That's another thing. Showcase high quality photos of your work. Put it on your website and put it in your Google business profile. Now, what it did was it, it, it looked at the competitors and it gave you some of the strong points of the competitors, right? And then it told you for JDI, emphasize your commitment to, to um, customer satisfaction. And, and you see, uh, include relevant keywords, right? Build, build local backlinks, get listed on directories and website, community forums, and other business pages. Meaning that in, in Pinellas Park or in the town that you're trying to rank, you want to get on directories located in your area. How do you do that? Type in the name of your town, quotation marks, directories. You'll see a whole mess of directories just located in your town and see if there's a place to add your link okay gather more reviews right show high quality photos of completed project projects Sus a satisfied customers right after you finish a roofing job take a picture with your customer post it on the website put it in a google business profile consider drone footage right especially if you're a roofer explore social media Put that content out on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. Engage with local communities and, and uh, customers online, right? So these are all the things that you need to do to get you over the hump. This is a quick video because like sometimes you do everything. You, you, you optimize your, your page, right? You optimize your, your website, rather. You optimize your Google business profile. You got five reviews this, this, uh, this week. And, you know, you need that little extra push. Like, what else can I do to rank? And I think this is a great way to do it. Just go to bard.google.com. And just fool around with it. Just like put in the top three people that are in uh, um, in Google Maps in your category, and say, "Hey, Bard, don't call him Barty because I always call him Barty. You, I don't want, don't steal that from me. But go over to Bard and say, "Hey, look, Bard, look, th these people are ranking. What you know? What, what do I need to do? And it'll give you information just for you. And that one little thing may be the thing to get you over the hump. And it only takes a couple of moments, and it's free, and anybody could use it, right?" So I just want to say thank you very much for watching. Most important thing, you're watching these tips, right? And, and we're trying to get more leads so we can make more money so we can take care of our family. So be good to your family. Be good to your wife. Be good to your kids. Clean up around the house. Take the dog out. My dog, wait. That's my dog snoring. He's sitting right next to me. That's him. And... Um, be good to your family, and we will catch you the next the next time. Probably tomorrow, I make another video. All right, guys, have a great day, and uh, we'll catch you later. Bye.